she's different than from Split. You know, she's really grown, and I think she's had this incredible experience, which even though it was frightening and terrifying, I think it gave her the permission to be herself and to stop blaming herself for a lot of things. So it's a, it's very interesting being Casey uh, 2.0. I think the the sort of legwork I did on Split and then coming in here is it's especially you know in the scenes with James it's so bizarre the natural patterns that you fall into with someone that you spent such a long period of time with and such an intense period of time with so we're just it's actually really beautiful to have the two of us come back together and to feel that connection again and 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 do it again it um it really aids I think it's a story that delves into people who have extraordinary abilities but you know doesn't take them to that fantastical place where like they can never be defeated it's literally just like the uh, quite soon but I think the first meeting with James is just so it, it both these characters are so broken and so flawed and they've been so hurt that the two of them together just have this bond that you can't you can't put it it's not romantic it's not you know there, there are all of these words that people put onto relationships but for this relationship it's literally just kindred spirits and kindred souls and I think having the chance to do that which you know when we finished split I had no idea that we'd get to see each other again that that was something that was going to happen so that was um I think seeing Bruce James and Sam being epic and then Sarah's you know, the, the new person to this crew, but she's so amazing and she's so great and I love watching her work. So I think, um, I'm, I'm just excited to see the movie. I'm excited to see these really talented people who are also incredibly lovely do their thing. I think that's... Hey there, here's today's daily fact. That slightly scandalous charcoal drawing of a topless Kate Winslet in Titanic was drawn by none other than the director himself, James Cameron. Now, if you want something done right, sometimes you just need to do it yourself. Now remember to click here below to subscribe for more content or on the side to watch another video.